So on this pour, I've got my black, lamp black, titanium white, and a little bit of copper, dazzling metallics copper. This is all deco art. These are Americana, and this is the dazzling metallics. Here's a cup I poured in out of earlier, just some black paint. So I'm going to just mix straight in to here. I'm going to try the tree ring pour. And this is a probably a weird combination of colors. I've had I've seen some beautiful ones where people did black, white, and gold. And um, so I'm going to try the copper just for the heck of it to see what it looks like. I would really love to get the results that they have gotten where it looks very, very 3D. I don't know if I can achieve that look. I'm just going to keep layering. These have Floetrol mixed in with them. My copper might have a drop or so of silicone. I really didn't want silicone in it, but I had already used the copper on another pour, and so there's a very good chance that there is some silicone in the copper, unfortunately. I have a 12 by 12 square canvas, and this was one I had done the black, white, and gold pour on, which I hated when it came out this way. I had some people that loved it. I hated it. It just was a total failure to me, and so I am happy to just pour over it again. making sure my camera is still going.
Well, I guess I'll just, um, I have some left in the cup, but I'm going to leave it. So definitely the silicone and the copper is coming out for sure. So I did not get that 3D look that I love of everybody else's, but I do like this pour better than the black, white, and gold that I had on here previously. So just for the heck of it, I'm doing a little tree ring pour right in the corner. Oh well, I tried. <laughs> Some people are just better at getting a 3D effect. Um, I do like the copper with it in a strange kind of way. It's just different from the gold. 
the gold for me just didn't turn out that nice and uh, I wasn't crazy about the gold. I'm going to tone that down just a little bit there. <coughs> Okay, I'm going to leave it alone.